Okay, traders. Now let's look at the short-term trading opportunities where the markets start trading sideways. And this is quite relevant because when we saw Donald Trump go into power in the US in 2017, the market started trading sideways very aggressively. And if you're trying to trade those yourself, you can come unstuck because there was huge momentum shifts around comments from Trump and a whole range of geopolitical events. Now, just looking at this, there are opportunities here, and I've done some thorough testing to make sure we can optimize the opportunities. Now, it really comes down to the trade mode. Now, if we're using auto trade, if the price is above the bull bear pivot line, Primetime Pro will buy, right? And if the price is below the bull bear pivot line, Primetime Pro will execute. This is the auto trade mode. So in that situation, in sideways moving markets, that's our worst case scenario. And I'll run through that in the next video. But for now, we can actually focus on trade mode. And you can actually have both buy and sell. But what we're trying to do is capture the big swings in momentum. And this happens a lot around geopolitical events. And I think we can really benefit from them. But there's a couple of things you need to modify. And one is your trade plan. Now, short-term charts, trading sideways moving markets. Usually, you think it would be a recipe for disaster. But you know what? After serious testing of Primetime Pro, I think we can actually get into these trades if we modify our trade plan. And what I mean by that is adjust the trade plan to sideways moving markets. Stop loss, 30 points. Take profit, say around 75 points. And the trailing stop feature will kick in at 30 points in the cash and trail the market by 30 points. That's our backstop to make sure once we're in the cash, our worst case scenario really is break even. Now let's have a look at the Euro here and assess where these sideways moving markets started. And if you can't actually see them on your chart, well, just add the bull bear pivot line because that will show you exactly where they are. Now you can see where the bull bear pivot line went from vertical to starting to flatten out, okay? And at this stage, I would be considering the markets to be trading sideways, pretty much from this area here. And it's trading sideways until it breaks down on the fundamental news that pushed Euro down up to around this level here. So we're looking from the 18th of September until probably about the 28th of September. Now let's just get some understanding around the trade mode. Now trade mode, okay, it will just execute on the signals that you have selected. Now you can actually change things. You can actually just buy or buy and sell. I think in sideways moving markets, especially behaving to geopolitical news, I think the best option is both buy and sell. It allows you to hit the top end of the spectrum with regards momentum, and that's what we're looking for. Now, with regards to the signals, this comes down to a bit of personal preference or maybe your risk appetite, okay? An early sell buy, well, that's an aggressive risk appetite. You're getting in early. If we came back and looked at a peak sell or buy, you're waiting a little bit longer, but you can also get caught up in a situation where where momentum starts to stall above or below the upper and lower levels. And that can catch us out occasionally. Or if you're looking for the least risk and you're patient and you don't mind missing the odd trade, well, you can use prime time buy and sell. Okay, so just trying to identify where the opportunities are here on this sideways moving market. So let me just put this into play using trade mode, both buy and sell and prime time buy and sell also. We've got our adjusted plan and we're all set to go. Maximum losing trades, very important, set to three, right? You do not want to get caught up having a huge amount of losses in sideways moving markets. You may even adjust that to two just to protect yourself when you first get started. Now, once again, identifying when the sideways moving markets is critical, right? And as I said, the bull bear pivot line as it starts to flatten out will be the key to signaling when that is the case, all right? You can see very clearly here, where the bull bear pivot line started trading sideways. So let me just put this into action with our modified trade plan and see how it would perform. Okay, we've got the strategy tester in play. Now let's just see how it plays out over the course of this couple of weeks. Now you get a couple of winning trades and you're tucking away a little bit of cash. Then you're followed by a loser and then a full take profit trade. Now, the best thing about this is you don't have to sit there and watch the market closely.
Another full winning trade there. Okay, so as you can see, using the trade mode with a modified trade plan, so we don't leave too much cash on the table, you can still take a good chunk of cash out of the market. Now, the best thing is these sideways moving markets can be in play for a couple of weeks at a time before the trend starts appearing. Now, usually if you're trading manually, you're probably staying out of those markets. So Primetime Pro is going to enable you to optimize your performance by trading these sideways moving markets. If you find you start losing money when you're trading sideways moving markets, then consider stopping and waiting for it to settle down or modify your trade plan to optimize your performance in those moving markets. This is really going to revolutionize your overall trading performance because now you're going to be trading in those periods where everything usually goes quiet and making money while you do so.